Dr. Paniam and her team of nurses and doctors, including Dr. Ishmael Ibrahim, immediately resuscitated him while calling Krisani Paragwanath Academic Hospital to receive the patient as he was a priority number one. Due to the critical and very unstable condition, Bara advised that Tumi be retained at Begim Langeni as he had a high risk injury and was too unstable to be transferred. This then prompted that a BMDH team must operate him on an emergency basis. The median stenotomy operation lasted for just over an hour and we want to congratulate our team for that because for me it was not going to be an hour definitely that we expected. Removing blood clots and stationing the heart muscle. Tumi was kept in the ICU for three days and then released to the surgical ward before finally being released discharged home on Friday, which was the 5th of May, 2023. I want to commend the Kim Langini team for the sterling work that they did for raising, to the, for raising up to the occasion. This just goes to demonstrate that with a conducive environment, a team spirit, our team is capable of doing so much more. Just on the 29th of March 2023, the surgical team at this hospital again repaired very rare hemia successfully, which is a D. garigotri hemia where the appendix was stuck in the formal canal. Less than 225 cases were even reported worldwide till now. The surgical team again is in the process of writing a case report on this issue, which is the team that is sitting with me as we speak. Because at Begim Langen, you only have three surgical doctors led by Dr. Ishmael. 